story. Now, we want to know what you think about this story. A Metro mom, she didn't think twice about protecting her two kids when a pair of burglars broke into her home. She shot and killed one of them. Neighbors say the home had been broken into a half dozen times, and they're proud of her for standing up for herself. Our Emily Wood has more on the break-in. People who live in this area say they've been victims of home invasions before, and they hope this one sends a message to the criminals who've been targeting them. You shouldn't have been there, and she had every right, every right to defend herself. She was supposed to defend herself. Police say a 30-year-old mother of two small children, both under age three, woke up to her house shaking early this morning. She was asleep in her bedroom with her children, uh, heard a loud noise, and of course we've had earthquakes recently in the area. That was her immediate thought. But what she found was two burglars standing in her living room. I suspect that these two suspects didn't realize anybody was home, and so they targeted the house they thought was unoccupied, and to their surprise someone was there and they were armed. Police say the terrified stay-at-home mom acted fast to defend herself and her children, grabbing a handgun and shooting both men. Police say one died instantly while the teenage suspect managed to get away. I'm proud of her. I really am. I mean, I probably wouldn't have had the nerve to do it, but I'm glad she did. People who live nearby say they're not surprised this went down the way it did. There have been break-ins here before, and those who live here say they hope this one sends a message. And in the last five years, it's just turned into hell on earth. No, we're not going to take it anymore. The people who live in this area say they plan to support this family, and the Midwest City Police Chief says the mother was within her rights to shoot the criminals. Reporting in Midwest City, Emily Wood, News 9. And we have heard from a lot of you about the woman's actions. Most of you support her. Mary says, good for that mother, and I would do the same thing. I'm not going to be a victim in my own home, especially when my children are there. And another says, heck yeah, way to go, Mama. These thugs picked the wrong house, and I'm glad she defended herself and her children. And one more person writes, first of all, I believe the mother was totally correct in her actions. It is sad that a life was lost, but that is the chance that these thugs pay for their crimes. You can leave us your comments at News9.com, the story right there on our front page.